So in this video, I'm going to show you how to go get some extra animations using Mixamo. Uh, just a brief uh, overview that these are the assets that I'm recommending that we're using with our class, which we have a bundle for education. Uh, and they're easy uh, and low poly. And that way, if your computer is not the best, it works really well. Okay. Um, there are better uh, assets in Unreal Marketplace, which I recommend if you have a better computer. And I'll look at those briefly as well. Uh, probably, in fact, we'll use the ones from Mixamo, which uh, are low res, but it doesn't matter as long as you're getting the story out there. That's what we mostly care about. So in Mixamo, uh, we're basically, uh, you know, log in, create an account. And what we're going to do is we're going to upload one of our animations. So over here, we have the knight that I had already mentioned that I want to use. So it's a very cool looking knight, you know, tough looking guy. That's what I want. So what I'm going to do now is... and by the way, you can always dock these, okay? I don't need it right now, so I'm going to close it. So I'm going to right-click on this pink one. So be careful. There's different ones. The green ones are the ones you drag in. The pink ones are uh, the animation with the skeletal mesh. So then what we're going to do is we're going to go to Asset Actions, and we're going to export it. And now we're going to download it. And I've already downloaded it to my D drive, but double-check. Where is it going to? Uh, make sure you put it somewhere that's easy. Because it will download by default in the uh, Unreal Asset, which is hard to go and download. So when I download it, make sure just defaults are fine. Uh, FBX 2013. And when... Uh, so now I'm going to go to my uh, Mixer mode that I've already opened. I'm just going to close that one and close that and go here. So we're going to log in. All right, so now I'm going to upload the character that I'm logged in. I'm going to go get my knight. He was on the D drive, so like I said, make sure you know where you put it. And he'll come in, and you'll notice there's no color. But don't worry, when we bring it back into Unreal Engine for this particular asset pack, it will be fine. The materials will get reapplied to it. So just wait a second. All right, so there he is. So our goal is to find a couple animations that we want to use in our story. So you need to think about this before you pick your animations. And I recommend that you storyboard starting now. Because now you know what the scene is. You know what the music is. And you kind of know what your character is. Another thing I'm going to emphasize is since we're kind of beginners, you should probably not use more than two characters. Maybe you even want to use just one. It looks like on an adventure. And you got to remember the theme for us is global warming for the contest we're participating in. But, uh, you know, as a classroom teacher, you could decide to make it whatever you want. So here's one defeated. So, you know, maybe that's something I would like to have in my scene. And I'm going to go with that. And just to know, like, look at this here. And sometimes, you know, you can add a little bit extra. And let's see, does that improve it? So you look at it and a little more emphasis. So I'm going to download that one. And um, this will use the default download settings of your browser. So double check. And I love Chrome because here you can go just go show in Finder. And go double check so it is in my download folder it's called download i defeated so now i'm going to go to my project and again just keep it wherever i downloaded it before make sure you're putting it in the same place so i'm going to right click and i am going to import this and under the d drive so um no under the download for me actually apologies so you know keep track of where you put yours i'm going to bring in whoops defeated and when you do bring it in make sure you have the same skeleton well it's usually the name of whatever you download so if you downloaded human knight skeleton well guess what it knows it remembers if it didn't uh, you would have to just click here and make sure you select it but it usually remembers and this is something that by default you may not have properly set up default is usually this so click on this and go animated time which is all you really need to do and then you import it Alrighty, so there's always errors. Just ignore them because they're going to work anyways. Um, and, you know, you may want to say, all right, I'm going to drop this defeated character. You need to look for the green defeated. So there he is. You drop it in. And uh, I'm just going to use the Alt key and the left, left mouse button just to look at him from the front. And if ever you, you want to move quickly, just press the F key, right? That's always a really good, and you know, maybe 
Uh, right now, I just want to see what he's going to look like and how this animation looks. So I go Alt S, which is uh, simulate, and I'll show you. So there you go. This is what it'll look like in the scene. Okay. So, you know, I'll give you a little trick too while we're at it. Press escape when you're done. Uh, you can actually um, right click and change um, asset actions. Give me a second here. Just need to remember here. So the other thing I also recommend that you do is go get all your animations for this character. You you're supposed to have planned it ahead of time, and that's really important because you'll work a lot harder otherwise. But you know that he's let's say doing this animation. Let's say you know he's doing a seated animation, and let's say you know he's doing a yelling animation. In fact, we can put all these in right now. Uh, so you go to Mixamo and download each one individually, just like we just did, okay? Now, once you've brought in the prod the character in Mixamo, you can just download all three or four or five animations quickly and uh, make sure you upload them to the same folder. That's really important. So file structure and organization is critical. So uh, I have these three. So these would be the ones for my scene, let's pretend. So I'm going to go...